This is going to be a quick video, an update process for the Omen 16L and what I attempted to do lately uh, when I'm trying to upgrade it. Hey guys, welcome back to Ohio Sense channel. My name is Ivan and today I'm going to show you one of the things that I try to attempt lately with the 16L. You guys seen some of my series of videos and I mentioned in the previous one that I'm going to upgrade the power supply and the main reason for upgrading the power supply is getting a better graphics card. Now in this video I tested putting the 1560 Ti. This is uh, the dual one from Asus, 16 gigabytes. Uh, I wanted to see what kind of performance we're going to get with this kind of hardware. Uh, and this is pretty compelling little uh, GPU that actually it's going pretty well in 1440p situations with the 16 gigabytes of RAM on board. Uh, runs fairly cool and quiet, uh, but uh, what I wanted to do in this video and show you is if you are keeping the existing 400 watt power supply inside this computer and trying to use this GPU, what your expectation is going to be. Now I'm going to show you the peak power wattage that is pulling from the wall when you have this uh, GPU inside and the highest I've seen is about 280 to 290 watts and you would think well 290 watts this is about 300 watts um, you have 100 watts of reserve in this power supply but the way this power supply is designed and the power is channeled through the different outputs the 8 pin PCI Express cable is not getting enough amperage so this is the main issue here and unfortunately i cannot document what exactly is happening with the monitor but i'm going to des describe it to you when the power is not enough you have high peak volume of demand from the gpu triple um, a titles games and the output of the gpu is cutting in and out so the monitor will go black and it will recover and then it will go black again and recover a certain period of time so I tested with the different GPUs, I put back the 4060 Ti, I put some other ones and the, as soon as you cross that threshold of 160, 180 watts for a GPU, which this one uh, by default should have around 180 watts power draw, uh, you are in the need of better power supply. Now what kind of power supply you can install here you will ask and I will I'll show you in a separate video what I got. Uh, the lowest one you can go by is the 500 watt. This one has uh, been sold everywhere. It has an HP have it on their store side. They also sell it on eBay. There's a couple other versions, the 550 watt. Those are also sold on eBay. And the highest one that I personally got is the 650 watt power supply sold on eBay. That is in their workstations, which are sharing the same body. They just have a higher or more demanding hardware inside. And with a 650 watt power supply, you're not gonna have any problems. Even if you get uh, 5070, 5070 Ti, something in a smaller form factor like that that can fit in the box, you're not gonna have problems. So word of advice, the the information from this video you can take is you can go probably as high as 4060 ti with the 400 watt power supply anything above i definitely recommend getting a newer power supply the 500 watt or more in order for you to really step it up to 1440p which this is my main reason for this gpu throwing it in and running some tests on 1440p instead of the 1080p that i've showed you in the past so yeah short and sweet this is what we found out you have to step it up for anything above 5060 Ti and hopefully you guys continue to enjoy this one and I really hope that none of you spent more than $799 for this particular Omen 60L SKU currently they're asking above $1000 and I for that kind of money I advise none of you go and buy it it is just absolutely insane and uh, anything under $799 is, is somewhat okay when it comes to the hardware inside so yeah that's pretty much it guys hit the thumbs up if you like the video check out the links in the description below if you want to support the channel directly it helps me tremendously to bring you videos like this regularly and as always guys you have a wonderful day